What's, what's up, my dude? Good to see you, bro. Good, man? I'm very good, very good. Good to see you. We're doing the Bruce Wayne trim. I actually liken my hair flow right now, so I don't want to take too much off it. Yeah, make me look like Batman. Let's do the Bruce Wayne. Okay, easy. But a bit on the longer side. Yep. The Bruce Wayne has been in France with supermodels on a boat for two weeks. Yeah, I was thinking about doing that buzz, but ultimately, I'm not ready for the buzz. No. Okay, I'm gonna take the glasses off. I just got these prescriptions, so I can see now. I think the buzz cut looks good when you get really, when you get a bit tanned, very chiseled. Mm. You know that my uh, my mother's father went bald very young. Mother's father went bald young, huh? Yeah, but I freaking. It's all in the mindset. <laughs> it's all in the mindset. If you feel like you have good hair, you have good hair. Yeah, you will I, just, have good I hair. just I knew it. You know, my when I was in grade like nine or ten, this teacher was like looking at me. He's like, "You're gonna go bald," and I said, "There's no way." Yeah. So, what are some other keys to this haircut, Darren? So some other keys that you really want to kind of focus on is just really creating texture as well. So after I've gone through, you can see I've gone through here and I've cut it quite solidly with a lot of form and shape, but to really give it that like lived in sort of texture, like, you know, we're going to try hard to make it look like we didn't try hard here is I'll just kind of go through and just soften to create a little bit of texture. So it looks a little bit more lived in, you know, with any great haircut, right? It's like really nice, clean outlines. And then like whatever you want the inside of the hair to do, it does. Right. So again, like tidying up these sideburns, giving yourself like a really nice clean outline on the neck. So I like the haircuts that are pretty effortless, natural that can just sit. I don't use any gel, any pomade. I literally use nothing, just a bit of water. So I like the haircuts that kind of you can do with that. The very structured ones where you gotta put in pom pomade and stuff. It's got, it's got so much fragrance, I don't use any of that stuff. What I like about the Bruce Wayne cut is it's effortless. You take a shower, you push your hair back and it just sits in place. And as you rock it, your hair starts to like get into its rhythm. It just kind of effortlessly falls into place. So I've never really used any gel or pomade and just, you know, the hair, I've trained the hair. I've trained the hair to sit in the right way. Who is this Bruce Wayne cut for? Like what kind of face shape does this work best for? Haircut works best for somebody who's got like a, like a squared off uh, jawline um, or somebody who's got a square or heart shape face shape. Um, reason being is because it's just going to accent that. So it's gonna add to it, right? Um, this also works for somebody who has, let's say somebody with like a slightly longer face because what's gonna happen is by having the sides a little bit longer, you're actually gonna widen the face a little bit just again, so now you're compensating for the length, so it's gonna balance out that face shape, right? What face shape do I have? So you have a squared, you, like you are a square, a square gets, man. Like okay. that is a squared off uh, face shape for sure that you have. And for someone that has a rounder face, what kind of cut is good? So you wanna go something like high and tight, really. A um, movie star cut, cause you gotta movie, lose some fat first. Movie star yeah. body. If your face is round, <laughs> you gotta cut about 20, 30 pounds of fat. Yeah, and then you can get whatever haircut you want. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so my first haircut I did with Darren, I actually had hair pretty much down to here. I had crazy long hair, a beard, and we cut my hair short, shaved off the beard, and I, I, I literally felt like I was, you ever seen Shrek 2, where he takes the potion, he's transformed, and he's like gorgeous, and he's like long locks of hair, <laughs> cute button nose, and he's walking through life, and he's getting all this attention. That's how I felt when I cut the hair with you and then I shaved the beard. I was walking around the street. I was getting so many eyeballs. I'm like, holy shit. This is like, this is, like, this is overwhelming. So Darren, if someone's in New York, LA, they want to get this cut, what should they tell their barber? So the thing you want to ask is, so first of all, say all scissors haircut. That's first and foremost. We're doing medium length hair. So that's the other thing you want to mention. And then I would say, Say you want hair starting at a finger's width and then slowly building up some more length as we get to the top. And then finally, where you wanna see the top. So we had talked about the hair falling just right at the top of your eyebrow and guess where we finished off? Just at the top of your eyebrow there, right? So that's the key takeaways, man. Scissor work, medium length hair, tailored, classic, traditional haircut, uh, along with just building length from a finger's width all the way up to the top. And, and what's the back? At the back, same thing. We're starting just a little bit longer than a finger's width. And then as I've come up, you can see here, we've gotten longer and longer and longer from the very bottom 
to the very top, the lengths of hair are getting gradually longer. The last thing I want to go through and do now is go through and create like a really strong outline. Like it's just too much of a juxtaposition. So what I'm doing here is I don't want to go through and create like a hard outline with some very soft sort of like uh, flowy hair. So I'm just going to create a outline here where it looks lived in just the way the haircut looks lived in. But it doesn't look egregious with like a barbered feel on like a tailored haircut. Yeah, let's take a, let me take a peek. Yeah, nice. Let me come over here. You finished the cut.